Friends, we welcome you to Colonial Park United Church of Christ, where no matter who you are or where you are on life's journey, you are welcome here. Thank you for joining us for this service and the style of today. Today, worship is filled with music, with candle lighting, and with silence and prayer. You are invited to have some candles right where you are, if you are able to light them right where you are. We will be lighting a few here on your behalf when we come to the time where we celebrate closer to the light, but we invite you to light them right where you are. Also, there are pauses in the service, moments of silence, in this recording, we invite you to pause the recording at those times to be in silence and in prayer and meditation for as long as you wish. Friends, welcome. Let us worship God together. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you never leave us. Stay close to us and teach us your ways again and again. Write your commandments on our hearts so that we may fully live them out. Send your counselor to teach us and remind us of your truth. Give us peace to overcome our troubles and fears. Amen. Thank you. 
you're invited to pause this recording at this time for a time of silent prayer and meditation, resuming when you are ready. Hear this reading from the Old Testament. In the 21st day of the seventh month, the word of the Lord came through the prophet Haggai. Speak to Zerubbabel, son of Shealtiel, governor of Judah, to Joshua, son of Zoadak, the high priest, and to the remnant of the people. Ask them, who of you is left who saw this house in its former glory. How does it look to you now? Does it not seem to you like nothing? But now be strong, Zerubbabel, declares the Lord. Be strong, Joshua, son of Zoadic, the high priest. Be strong, all you people of the land, declares the Lord and work, for I am with you, declares the Lord Almighty. This is what I covenanted with you when you came out of Egypt, and my spirit remains among you. Do not fear. This is what the Lord Almighty says. In a little while, I will once more shake the heavens and the earth, the sea and the dry land. I will shake all nations and what is desired by all nations will come and I will fill this house with glory, says the Lord Almighty. The silver is mine and the gold is mine, declares the Lord Almighty. The glory of this present house will be greater than the glory of the former house, says the Lord Almighty. And in this place, I will grant peace, declares the Lord Almighty.
Once again, you are invited to pause this recording for a time of silent prayer, resuming when you are ready. Hear this reading from the Gospels. The crowd spoke up. We have heard from the law that the Messiah will remain forever. So how can you say the Son of Man must be lifted up? Who is this Son of Man? Then Jesus told them, You are going to have the light just a little while longer. Walk while you have the light before darkness overtakes you. Whoever walks in the dark does not know where they are going. Believe in the light while you have the light, so that you may become children of the light. When he had finished speaking, Jesus left and hid himself from them. Friends, let us join in prayer. 
faithful God of love. You blessed us with your servant son so that we might know how to serve your people with justice and with mercy. We gather the needs of ourselves, <clears throat> we gather the needs of ourselves and others and offer them to you in faith and love, seeking to be strengthened to meet them. For those who are sick and carrying heavy burdens, For those bent low by the anguish and grief. For the one filled with worry over a job, a relationship, or a decision to be made. Meet each one of these in their need, we pray, with healing, comfort, communion, and hope. In love, we pray with those whose hearts are filled with joy. For those who enjoy the company of family and friends. for those celebrating an accomplishment or a new beginning. For the one who has found healing and hope. Meet us in our happiness and hallow it by your presence. Shape us and transform us by your grace, that we may grow in wisdom and in confidence, never faltering until we have done all that you desire to bring your realm of shalom to fulfillment. Amen. And let us join together in the prayer of our Savior using the words most familiar to you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Friends, we come to a time where we celebrate the light. And as we read today, we celebrate being children of the light, those who walk in the light and closer to the light than to the darkness. So you are invited to light a candle right where you are. We will light some here on your behalf. Let us come praying closer to the light. 
in celebration of that light on our path.
won't you join me in prayer? Jesus, our peace, by the Holy Spirit, you always come to us. And in the deepest part of our soul, there is the wonder of a presence. Blessed be those who are seeking God and God's peace. Amen. My friends, the God of infinite goodness throughout the ages has persevered in claiming and reclaiming all people. Surrounded with witnesses to aid in your journey, renew your call to repentance. God grants us the time to fashion our lives anew. Let us receive it through Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen.